Now I'm going to go down here and try to find some ferns for my amphibian habitat once I make it. Okay, I've got ferns all right there, different sizes, different kinds. And then when I was down there at the little creek down there, I actually caught two little crayfish. You can see them there. I'm going to put them in the water part of the sound of the cage. And then in here, I've got all my creatures plus a bunch of moss. So yeah, that'll be fun. Now I just have to bring all this home. I'll see you when I get back. Now that I'm back at my garage, I have to sort out creatures from other stuff I have here. crickets but I guess not. Still a lot though. Man, these are so pretty. Now I'm gonna fill up this little container with rocks for salamander. That for one that way it doesn't uh, drown in too much water. And two, it just looks nicer than plastic. Okay, so now I've got this little water thing in here for the rocks. I just put a little crayfish, two crayfish in there. One right here, one right there. So it's right there now. And then now I'm going to fill this thing up with dirt and then put some ferns and other things in it. And I think we should be good to go. I think I overdid it. I'm probably going to have some trouble finding salamander once I put it in there. Okay, let's see. Let get him out. So here he is. My mud, mud salamander. I haven't named him yet. So if you think of any good things, comment down below. Okay, buddy. Your new home. No, don't go in here. Let's go right here. Jeez. Okay. Goodness, you are loud. You are loud crickets. Very loud crickets. I should have gotten quiet crickets, but there are no such thing. Now I'm gonna put some worms in here to be, as I've heard in the video, the cleanup crew. So I'm guessing it's just going to clean up all the waste and dead matter and all that. Okay, there we go. Now I think we should be good to go on everything.